I'm a born and raised Kauai resident who resides in beautiful Keikaha with my family and two beautiful boys. As a resident and a mother, why would I work for a company if these lies were true? My friends and family live in these towns. If these lies were true, I wouldn't be able to bear our fourth generation children, which I have two, who has worked, who has lived in this agriculture town, and I worked in those fields pregnant. As a proud employee of one of the seed companies, not chemical companies, that will be regulated, I ask council to consider these costs and devastations before imposing extreme restrictions on farms that grow commercial seed on Hawaii. First, more government expenses. This bill will create a costly new bureaucracy in our government to administer a new, more restrictive permitting process for any pesticide use and to develop a complex EIS to planning of GMO crops. These, this bureaucracy will duplicate existing processes and regulations that we all pay for in the state and fed level. Two, if these subsidy companies were to leave, our jobs will, also, will be affected, and not only the seed company jobs, but the other companies that reside in these towns will be affected as well, such as restaurants, for, um, contractors, and uh, others. The other is a loss of community. You guys remember we lost Manau Camp. I'm scared to see the skeleton town that could have on the west side if this bill were to pass. People who worked at these seed companies are our friends and our neighbors, and the community will not be the same. If this bill is truly the right to know, then we need to stop profiling the seed companies as there's many other industries that use chemicals as well. Driving home to Kekaha one day, I saw the county spraying the fire hydrants with no PPE and, I, and no signs as I run and ride bike through that area. And then if this is the right to know, I would like to know what my neighbor sprays as my kid grabs their soccer ball in their yard. Please, I consider the facts and the costs, and I oppose Bill 2491. Mahalo.